We welcome you back and glad to have you with us here on WKYT. You likely know her best from her role on the show 24. She's a dynamic writer and performer, and you can see her at Comedy Off Broadway this weekend. In fact, we, she opened up last night. Absolutely, and we are happy to welcome Mary Lynn Ricecub to our studio this morning. Thank you very much for coming Hi, in. Hi, thanks glad for saying my name so correctly. <laughs> it just rolled out of your mouth like. I'm glad I oh, did. Thank you very she's much. Good. Thank you. <laughs> We're glad to have you here. Have you been to Kentucky before? I've been here once before. It was a whirlwind, and I'm back. Um, it's a very nice place. It's a lot colder than I thought it would be. Yeah. It's a lot colder than we would like it to be right, right now. What's happening? I don't know. I don't think you nice. guys got like a real winter here. We did last year, but it, uh, tomorrow uh, tomorrow's going to be pretty nice. So before your show, get out and take a stroll or something. You I know? will. You can right. enjoy it yeah. then. Now uh, we understand you had a show last night. I uh, you had a good time out there, yeah. Yeah, um, yes. What can people expect when they come out? What's your show like? I was just thinking of the uh, news guy. Oh, our weather guy. Yeah. Mike, Mike Linden was Yeah, out we there. had some you fun. You picked on him. He, yeah, he, well, he wore his purple shoes. Yeah. And I he said, needed your wife picked pick on. those out for you. Uh, <laughs> and then afterwards, he was like, I picked these out myself. <laughs> like, good for you. But you know, you, you know, can't win with women. Those. It's like... He looked great, but then I had to make fun of him and yeah. give the credit to his wife. Yeah, so he, yeah. he wanted to make sure I knew. What he said was interesting. This he knew you from the TV show, yeah. but he didn't have any idea you do stand up. Well, yeah, that's also kind of makes me laugh because there's a lot of people that you know buy the tickets because they know me from 24, and so they're excited. But then when they see me, it's this weird like the more that I speak, the more that it's apparent that I'm not really a computer genius <laughs> at all. <laughs> who could save the world from a terrorist attack. So I don't know if that's um, comforting or discomforting when people Boy, see me. What a cult following that show had. Yeah. So popular. Did you have any idea when you were starting it what it was going to be like? No, I mean, I had only done comedies before that. So that was the first drama that's I had switch. ever been on. <laughs> yeah, and so I didn't even know if, I mean, I had confidence in my acting abilities, but I didn't know how I would fit on that show and so when I started it was just three episodes and four episodes and early on I started trying to talk like this because I thought <laughs> I, I was like I'm gonna get fired because I don't fit into this show but then it ended out you I'm obviously kind of fit in. Yeah. yeah you really did <laughs> they wanted you for you oh purple shoe guys here by the way he'll probably come so oh, I think he's wanting to defend himself again <laughs> he has different shoes on today darn it what are the hot topics <laughs> when you hit the stage tonight uh, you know I talk about um, I hit on being tw uh, on being on 24 mm -hmm. a little bit and kind of discuss that with people, the difference between that and my stand-up. And then it's very personal. It's a lot of stuff from my life um, about getting married and getting pregnant by accident. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of good stuff in there. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm sure. All right. Uh, your chance to see her tonight out at Comedy Off Broadway and tonight and tomorrow, yep. in fact. All Come right. Thanks for coming in Appreciate today. Glad here. to have you here.